Now, is Israel expecting a major Iranian attack to be launched within days? Reports are indicating that Israeli intelligence officials believe that Iran has settled on attacking Israel in the coming days. Tehran's expected retaliation could even come before Thursday. Amid anticipation of an Iranian attack, the Iran-backed Hezbollah group kept up its offensive for a second night in a row on Monday. 30 rockets were fired into northern Israel from Lebanon. There are no reports, however, of damage. This one follows a similar barrage from the Hezbollah on Sunday night as well. <laughs> Hezbollah has also vowed revenge against Israel over the assassination of its senior commander, Fort Shukr. An attack by Iran, Iran uh, Iranian forces uh, is being speculated even before the scheduled ceasefire talks in Cairo on August 15. Hamas has announced that it will not be participating in the talks in Cairo. Now, according to new Axios report, Defense Minister Yoav Gallant has spoken to the U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin on Sunday. He told him that Iran's military preparations are pointing to a large-scale attack on Israel. The Pentagon later confirmed this call, adding that Austin had ordered the deployment of the USS Georgia guided missile submarine to West Asia. This deployment comes amid soaring tensions, but remember, announcing the movement of a submarine is rare for the United States. Reiterating America's commitment to take every possible step to defend Israel, the Pentagon statement noted that strengthening of U.S. military forces in the region is also said. Uh, it is also said that the U.S. has ordered a strike group of fighter jets and Navy warships to accelerate its deployment in West Asia. The, the USS uh, Abraham Lincoln strike group has been ordered to the region to replace the USS Theodore Roosevelt Carrier Strike Group, which is scheduled to begin heading back to the US. The Lincoln has lately been in the Asia Pacific and amid escalating tensions had already been ordered to the Central Command area. Last week, Austin said the, Link the Lincoln would arrive in the region by the end of the month. Now. The latest order by the Pentagon does not indicate how much more quickly the Lincoln will steam to West Asia. Other media reports also say that as per Israel's updated assessment, Tehran intends to launch a major attack this week. This attack is expected to be even bigger in scale than the drone and missile attacks in April. However, the Israeli military has stressed that instructions to civilians remain unchanged. Recent claims indicated that Iran, under heavy international pressure, had given up on its intention to launch a large-scale attack in response to Haniyeh's assassination. But the newly emerging reports suggest otherwise. As per the reports, the issue is divisive within Iran, and President Masoud Pezizkian wants to avoid a harsh response while the Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps wants to launch an even larger attack than in April. And Hezbollah has claimed responsibility for the overnight strikes on Israel. Has the imminent attack from Iran and its proxies already begun? Our correspondent Jody Cohen tells us more. So according to the Hezbollah-affiliated al Mayadeen site, Hezbollah has claimed responsibility for 30 rockets that were launched from Lebanon towards Israel on Sunday night. Now, these strikes are not thought to be the imminent strike that's expected. Israeli Defense Minister Yoav Gallant spoke with U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin. He reportedly said that they believe that Iran's military pre preparations suggest that Iran is getting ready for a large-scale attack on Israel. And according to reports, this could be a combined attack by Iran and Hezbollah either simultaneously or following each other. Now the attack is expected to be larger than Iran's strikes in April. Remember that involved 350 Iranian drones, ballistic and cruise missiles, 99% of which were intercepted by Israel and the international coalition that we saw. Now in a sign of escalating tensions, the US has said that they've moved a guided missile submarine to the region and also ordered the Abraham Lincoln's strike group to speed up its deployment.
For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.